Hey everyone, my name is Jason Kwan and I am the Youth Engagement Coordinator at AKT. So within the Youth Engagement team, we support our young people who work with AKT outside of their housing needs. So this could cover many things such as helping them build general life skills, um, helping them with their career development, helping them with their education, helping them build community spaces, uh, and also facilitating spaces that they can enter and just be themselves. Um, so obviously the biggest loss during lockdown has been the loss of physical spaces. So we have moved our spaces online and so we've been hanging out on Zoom and we've been hanging out on Discord um, and it's created a whole different atmosphere because it's sort of broken down the geographical barriers we used to have um, and we've been able to unite young people all over the UK to hang out together um, and to share their experiences during lockdown. So currently within the Youth Engagement Program, we're supporting young people through different ways. Um, mostly this includes our online hangouts, which happen every Monday and Thursdays for the young people we work with. And so these are done over Zoom and over Discord, which is more of an in-depth platform. Um, Discord allows people to have text chats, voice chats, and video chats, send memes, share music, and listen to music together. Um, and it's created quite a dynamic space for young people to interact, which has been really exciting. Um, another thing we're doing are workshops, um, online and over Zoom. Um, we're all, we've also just launched a zine called Scene. And the idea of Scene is to allow young people to express themselves and present themselves and represent themselves in the way that they want to be seen and for them to have an artistic platform to express themselves. Um, I think over lockdown, a lot of young people have been experiencing social isolation. And so having these online um, kind of communities has been really helpful for all of us, including myself. Um, to feel more connected with my community and my people. Every year we usually have our youth conference which we've called AKT Weekend this year as we've extended it to Friday, Saturday, Sunday in June. Um, and obviously because of um, COVID-19 and the pandemic and lockdown, we've been unable to carry it out. Um, however, we will be doing it hopefully next year. Um, AKT Weekend was an opportunity to bring young people from all over the country together for a few days of, you know, fun community building, panel discussions, and for them to meet people from all over the country. Um, so it was going to be an amazing opportunity for everyone to get together. Um, however, I think we've been able to replicate a lot of that type of um, engagement online. The youth engagement program is really important for a lot of our young people because when you are living in an abusive or a hostile environment or if you're experiencing homelessness or facing a lot of rejection, um, it's really great to have a space where you can completely be yourselves, be accepted by your community and also be around people who understand how you're feeling and understand what you're going through um, without necessarily having to discuss it. And I think during lockdown, a lot of young people have been experiencing social isolation, you know, not being able to access their communities. And so having these spaces um, with the Youth Engagement Program have been really helpful for all of us to have a very open dialogue and communication about what is going on, our experiences, and also just to have a lot of fun.